Uh, today I have an old mercury thermostat and I'm going to be taking it apart and taking apart the glass tube with the mercury inside. So this is an old thermostat and I'm going to open it up and there's the mercury inside you can see in that little glass tube and this is a bimetal so when you look through it that tells you the temperature and this thing goes back and forth and depending on how the mercury is tilted it'll either turn on or turn off or it'll break the circuit when it is complete with heating so let's take it apart I have this tray here so that I don't get any contamination if it potentially breaks. And we have this piece of bimetal. Well, actually, we can forget about that for now. We're looking for this mercury part. So, this comes out now. Let's see if this will come out. Now, here we have the mercury. And let's see if we can show this bimetal uh, heating up and moving. If I just take a lighter, I should be able to show this. Alright, so if you can see this position of the metal. And immediately begins to uncoil. So that's bimetal. But now we still need to extract this mercury bulb. And you can see a little mercury inside of there contacting the two wires. Alright, you can now see that the bimetal is right back to its original position. You can now see the mercury switch after I've unclipped it from the thermostat housing and I used a little acetone to clean off the red adhesive. So it's really nice and clear and you can see the, mer the mercury perfectly. And this is great for something like an element collection, but just be sure not to break it because mercury is very dangerous. Thanks for watching. And here's how I'm going to be storing my mercury just to make sure it's safe and not going to break.